In the meantime, the Integrity Commission has sought to clarify the reasons why it says Dirk Harrison has not been appointed to the post of Director of Corruption Prosecutions. TBJ's Prince Moore reports. February 22, 2018, the new Integrity Commission came into being. A merger of the former offices of the Contractor General, the Commission for the Prevention of Corruption and the old Integrity Commission. And with it, questions over whether the former Contractor General Dirk Harrison will be appointed to the post of Director of Corruption Prosecutions. He has been acting in that post for more than a year. The Integrity Commission, facing the media on Monday, sought to clarify the situation. The matter pertaining to Mr. Dirk Harrison was not created by this commission. But he noted that the commission must solve the issue, but indicated it has not been easy. On the appointed day, Mr. Harrison held an instrument of appointment as the former contractor general on a fixed-term contract for a period of seven years, which would expire sometime in and around March of 2020. That reality, the commissioner said, meant the former contractor general is entitled to a full pension and indicated that Mr. Harrison has pursued a course of action to ensure that is the case. The solicitor general has been asked to comment on the matter. The Integrity Commission said it's awaiting a reply, though an April 15, 2019 letter to the Integrity Chairman Justice Carl Harrison under the signature of the Solicitor General outlined that the former Contractor General should be paid pension when he retires, as long as his service as Contractor General and in the Integrity Commission amounts to no less than seven years. He indicated to the Commission by way of an email dated February 16th, 2019, that he would consider no position in the Commission until the matter of his pension is resolved. While those issues are to be resolved, the Commission said it will move ahead to fill the position Dirk Harrison now acts in, as well as others. Approval came from the Finance Ministry on Friday for the posts to be filled. And so we will move with dispatch in advertising those posts. And we have made it quite clear to all the incumbents who have been acting in these positions that they are entitled to apply as well. And we hold interviews and to select the best of candidates for this commission. But no word there whether Dirk Harrison will be favored for the position of Director of Corruption Prosecutions. He also adds that at no time did the commission suggested a payout for Mr. Harrison, which has been interpreted as being that he would be discarded. The man himself was absent from the press briefing. He sent an apology. Prince Moore, TVJ News.